Yeah. Okay. Okay, so uh, I uh, figured out my mistake, and so now we're back. And so now we are going to do a, a, a simple editor with the double density in the vertical orientation. So the vertical orientation being this way. So now, um, I'm only going to do this for this patch. So we say, okay, and I, 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 you see it had it there temporarily, but I, I'm going to do this again. So what we do is we first define the first density, which is a 1, 2, 3, 4 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it's a five row, sorry, uh, is that right? Yeah. Uh, this is confusing, you'll Four see. Four row, huh? It's actually reversed. Uh -huh. um, so you'll see it's one, two, three, four, five by one, two, three, four. Okay. So that's fine. Now we click over here, and this is the second density on this side. Now this is one, two, three, four, five by one, two, three. So the second density is five by three. Okay, so now, so we have first density, we have second density. So let's fill these in. So we just click this, this automatically fills them in in this order. We fill in the channels on the second density. So it knows to start the numbering with, with where you continued off. Now, you'll, you'll notice the first thing I have to do is I have to calculate my measurement uh, uh, channels. So I click that and it defines all the channels where they, where they should be normally. Now, once I do that, I can calculate the double density channels. So I click this. And what you'll see is now it moves the, the orientation of the optodes. So it's red, red, blue, blue, red, red, blue, uh, et cetera, et cetera. And you'll see that now what we have is we have channels that are three centimeters apart and channels that are one and a half centimeters apart. Mm -hmm. So theoretically, with development of future algorithms, you should be able to do some tomography on this type of information with two layers, with two depth layers. Mm -hmm. And you could probably interpolate through those depth layers somehow. That, in my opinion, that's not developed well enough yet to, to, to utilize that. But regardless, this gives you a higher density calculation of the, the, uh, the, the channels on a person's head. So that's, uh, that's how you set it up. And yeah, that's just the basics. Mm -hmm. um, can be done, uh, and, and you can define these patches any way you want. Uh, you, can you can build anything you want out of these little plastic pieces. They're, they're provided by Shimazu. Um, it's just a limitation of, of, of how many optodes you have. And you can have 40 emitters and 40 detectors that you can play with. So this one only requires a total of, uh, how many did I put on here? One, uh, one, two, three, four, five, by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 35. Uh, so we actually have 80, so mm -hmm. this is only half of what's theoretically possible. Mm -hmm. Okay, anyway. Very good.